Welcome to Clean Tech, home of daily technology news and reviews, and today it's a different video. Today we're going to talk about how to record audio on your MacBook. Today's video is brought to you by Clean Phone. More on them at the end of the video. So it's a pretty straightforward title, people. A lot of people have questions around this. If there's a one way, multiple ways, uh, which one of them is the easier one. So yeah, that's what we're going to be discussing today. Let's jump right in. Uh, as per the article, if you're interested in recording audio on your MacBook, there are all kinds of ways to do it. No surprise there. Uh, there are a number of third-party apps that can record your voice, but macOS also offers several tools that you can use with no installation required. And that's exactly what we're going to be discussing today. Before you start recording, make sure whatever mic you're using is on, connected, and working, obviously. Uh, the MacBook's built-in microphones can record as well, but an external microphone may offer better quality. So, I mean, definitely th there's a lot of peripherals uh, out these days, whether it's a webcam or, you know, like anything is basically capable of uh, recording your audio these days. But, um, you know, having a dedicated microphone such as this one that I'm using is always going to produce better quality as opposed to the inbuilt microphones that you get in any of your devices, whether it's uh, your MacBook, your smartphone, your laptop, uh, your headphones, whatever. But yeah, uh, just make sure the microphone that you want to use is selected and uh, from there on, let's continue. Option one would be to record using a QuickTime player. Uh, that's the name of the software. Um, so in order to do that, first up, open QuickTime Player, click File, hit New Audio Recording, and click the Record button. For those of you who don't know, it's the red circle in the middle of the window to start recording. Once you're done, click it again to stop your recording. After that, just click File and hit Save. You'll get a pop-up, name the recording, and choose where you'd like to save it. Once you're done with that, your recording will be saved in said directory, ready for you to play back or use as per your liking. In QuickTime, you can also adjust the volume control on the bottom of the window in order to hear the audio you're recording. Pretty straightforward. Next up, we're going to figure out how to record audio on a MacBook using voice memos. So first up, open up the Voice Memos app, click the record button, again it's the red circle. To pause the recording, click it again. Uh, when you're finished, just click done. Simple. So obviously, uh, for those of you who are wondering, Voice Memos is the simpler way to record. It doesn't uh, require you to install anything, it's uh, pretty much, you know, packaged in the MacBook itself. So you would just search for the app, or open it, hit the red button and you know uh, stop it or click on done once you're done um, you'll see the recording pop up on the left side of the window the file will automatically be saved with the name new recording there is an alternative it will save as the name of the location where you made the recording if you select location based naming in preferences and if you've given voice memos location permissions but yeah, those are uh, two of the many ways you can record audio on your MacBook. Obviously, the more simpler ones. And uh, yeah, hope this video has helped. Let me know if there's anything else that I can help you with. And I'll see you guys down in the comment section below. Clean Phone is the perfect phone for your kids because it allows you to manage everything on the phone remotely. It has tons of amazing features such as easily allowing you to pick and choose which apps and games your child can use, provides you access to active phone monitoring including SMS and phone call usage, allows you to control how long and how often your kids can use apps or the internet. You can even check their call and SMS logs including inbound and outbound calls and messages and it is the perfect way to manage their screen time. Check them out in the description box down below. Thank you so much for watching and you have a great day.